Hey, what's going on? This is Jordan Wagner with PremierGuitar.com here with Mr. Joe Naylor and Reeves Gabrels. And they're both going to talk to us today about Reeves' new signature Reverend guitar. How you doing? Good. How you doing? Doing great. Yeah. Doing? yeah. Thanks so much for your time, guys. Appreciate it. Hey, no problem. So uh, can you run us through some of the features of the new instrument? Sure, I'd love to. Uh, I guess we'll start at the headstock, work our way down. Uh, Reeves Gabriel signature model, of course, and there's the signature to prove it. And also, these little pin lock tuners, you see these on all the reverends. And all you do is you stick the, stick the string through, turn the knob, and it uh, automatically locks the string. So that's a standard feature. Uh, this is a maple neck, 25 and a half inch scale. And it also has binding on the side, which makes for some very visible side dots. And it has graphite nuts, two-way truss rod. Coming down to the body, we have a flame maple top. The back is a lightweight and very resonant Carina solid body. Neck pickup is the DiMarzio Fast Track 1, which is a really cool pickup. It's a lot like a Strat pickup, has a little more uh, mid range, a little more punch to it, and no hum. And then you have the Reverend Humbucker. This one, uh, we took the cover off it to make it a little hotter, a little brighter. Uh, so basically, what you end up with is a good combination of uh, power and clarity, which Reeves likes. Uh, two pneumatic type bridge setup here. This is kind of an, a custom feature here is this toggle switch. Typically you would have the slot type selector. Right. Uh, we replace that with a toggle switch. As you can see it has an up and down angle to it as opposed to going across. But the cool thing about it is uh, the user could uh, adjust it to just about any angle he wants. Whatever's more comfortable for your finger sweep. And then we have a master volume here, master tone. And this here is the Reverend Secret Weapon. This is the bass contour control. And what this does is it rolls off bass frequencies, and that allows you to revoice the pickups. So you can go from like a thin percussive type tone with the bait with it off, and then you can put it all the way up, and you have your standard thick humbucking tones. So it makes the guitar very versatile. Um, but yeah, I mean that's that's basically the features. It's Versatile, solid, uh, good all-around guitar, um, and let's hear it. But, uh, Mr. Corrales, show us what it sounds like.
that's just me. Um, and then there's also, you know, there's also the conventional tone control. Is that with the bass knob, uh, bass control knob? Rolled off, yeah. And if you, yeah, and if you thin it out, you can still, it'll brighten it up, but still maintain the, you can thin it out with the bass roll off. tone controls rolled off on my regular humbucker guitars will usually fight you on that one. But and on top of that, you can if you pull that out, you can get that sort of and use combine the pickups, you can get that almost Albert Collins. You know, to make to make the like you know to make the point. articulation on the neck pickup. Thank you. Uh, but uh, sometimes neck pickups will get muddy even on strats. Yeah. I really like how much cut it's got in almost every position. You can dial it in or you can, you know, if you don't want to do that. Plus, you know, when you're going for that sort of Stratocaster neck pickup sound, if you play closer to the pickup, it's sound. That's you know, that the physicality of the Stratocaster has always made people play there, yeah. kind of. So that <laughs> sounds different than going back by the bridge. It's still the same pickup. hard to hear. Uh, and locking tuners. Thank you so much, man. It's killer. Appreciate it. It's an honor. So, Joe, where can uh, people find out more information about this and uh, any sort of pricing information they've given out yet? Yeah, you want to go to reverendguitars.com. And we have a network of uh, nationwide dealers. And the list price is on the website, but if you want to get the street price, uh, you want to call uh, your dealer up and uh, work from there. But reverendguitars.com. Thank you so much for your time. Well, Sounds your killer. And again, thank you. This is Jordan Wagner, and you're watching premierguitar.com.